Welcome to Five Fires YouTube. Today we got some breaking news from Disneyland. Let's fire it up. So in today's video, we're going to be talking about the response. The response to Universal Studios Hollywood. As we had that breaking news from Universal that Production Central, Animal Actors, and Special Effects will be permanently closing January 8th for an upcoming new attraction. Nobody knows timelines, project theming, nothing. Just something's coming. I, I don't know what. Hoping to find out more information because that, that's exciting. But we were talking about it yesterday that there's no way Disneyland doesn't respond with something. There's just no way. They, 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 they love being in the spotlight. It's a proven thing. Disney, anytime anything big happens at any other theme park, they respond. Uh, and this is their response. The treehouse. We finally get information on the treehouse. And you best believe they've been sitting on this news forever. They've, they've known what this looks like. They've had this concept art forever. Uh, as I've said before, it almost seems like they've just taken way too long uh, on any hype announcement for the treehouse. Um this is going to be Adventureland Treehouse at Disneyland Park returns in fresh new way 2023. What we previously had at the treehouse was Tarzan's Treehouse. Uh, I must admit, for me personally, I went in there maybe once or twice a year. <laughs> it was very rare that I would go inside the treehouse. So for them to retheme, reimagine this treehouse and bring more life to it, I was very excited. Very excited uh, to, to to see what step they were going to take with the treehouse. And we finally got our answer. And I'll give my reaction and opinion to this announcement uh, at the very end. But let's read the Disney Parks blog and go over this information. We know the Disneyland Resort fans have been eager. Have we really been eager? Uh, I feel like we were months ago. <laughs> <laughs> to learn about the enhancements coming to the beloved treehouse in Adventureland at Disneyland Park. Paying tribute to the original treehouse, uh, built in 1962, hit movie Swiss Family Robinson, the Adventureland treehouse inspired by Walt Disney's Swiss Family Robinson will, uh, will return in a fresh new way at Disneyland Park 2023. The Adventure... Oh, close it. The Adventureland Treehouse will showcase wondrous new environments created amongst the branches of tree on the shores of the jungle where guests will once again enter the giant water wheel and follow the wood rope stairways up, up, up into the boughs. Here we have another photo. Um, personally, I don't recall ever seeing Family or Swiss Family Robinson movie or anything media-wise uh, on that concept or that that theme so this is all new to me uh when i look at this it's pretty cool uh are kids gonna like this you know that's my first reaction to all this because kids are kind of the ones who go into the treehouse uh so i hope whatever interaction and and fun is coming through here in this treehouse uh it involves like the idea of a kid going in there you know and <laughs> i don't want to i don't want to Toot toot our own horn, but we were talking about how Disney Plus is king. Disney Plus is the ruler of the land. It dictates wherever the future goes now. And we we said on Speculation Sunday many times that a Swiss Family Robinson shows coming right down the line on Disney Plus. And why not have it be Disney Plus related? Because everything's Disney Plus these days. And what do you what do you know? Disney Plus uh, once again strikes, and we're getting a Swiss Family Robinson treehouse because the show's around the corner. Instead of Encanto, a lot of people were saying Encanto. They were hoping it was. Uh, what are your thoughts? I, I would love to hear from you. Would you have just preferred Encanto theme, or is is this Swiss Family Robinson theme uh, a better direction? You know what I mean. I'm curious to hear what everybody says in the comments. So post in the comments if you haven't already. <sighs> like when I look at this, is this going to be a room you could walk into? Or is this going to be like you could see it through a window, you know? I, I, I don't know. I don't know. It's just concept art. Here you'll find fascinating rooms that the family... Ah, sorry that keeps coming up. 
You will find fascinating rooms that the family and the new story created for one another from the mother's music den as depicted in the concept art above and the young son's nature room to teenage daughter's astronomer's loft. All things are fashioned from found objects, natural resources, and pure ingenuity. For those who rather stay on terra firma, the bottom floor will showcase an indigenous kitchen and dining room along with father's art studio, displayed hand-drawn sketches, painting, and paintings of each of the rooms. Walt Disney Imagineers are hard at work at, and delighted to bring the classic back in a fresh way, full of magic, enchantment, and wonder. After all, who wouldn't want to live in a tree in Disneyland? It also says we look forward to sharing an opening date and more details about the new Adventureland Treehouse coming to Disneyland Park in the near future. So there you have it, everybody. The Mother's Music Room. And then the Treehouse. What do we see? Uh, one of the things that my buddy Danny, he spotted out right away was the fact that it had this like logo that involves S E A and it's all the way on the left side right here, right there. So this is it, everybody. This is on the other side of the walls, Adventureland Treehouse. So you would enter here, go up the treehouse, and, uh, I kind of just, it's going to look cool. It's a good addition to uh, Adventureland. Here we have like a lookout spot. It looks like this is the music where the, the music, mother's music room or whatever. And then here we have a telescope. Not too sure what's going on up there. Kind of looks like floral. Hmm. Well, I'll look more into this and see if I could get more details that come down the line. But this is just the breaking news of everything. Uh, when I see this, this looks really cool. Uh, our kids, is, is this something kids are going to have fun with? Is this going to be a hit? <laughs> is this Disney Plus show going to be that good that we would love to have it at Disneyland? Uh do we want Tarzan's treehouse back? <laughs> I don't know. Um, I'm excited to walk through it. Uh, the the repeatability. Like, do I want to keep going through this? Is it going to be Magic Band accessible? In this whole article, not one thing about Magic Band. <laughs> uh, I hope it has some type of Magic Band interactivity because that will be super cool where you could tap it an animation happens, a sound, audio, maybe uh, light up features. I, I don't know. Something cool. I hope it does. I hope it does. But very interesting. Uh, I'm just going to throw it out there. Throwing it out there. If Disneyland is trying to go back to something that came in 1962, I don't see why not bring People Mover back. If they're trying to hit nostalgia, Disneyland rather go backwards than forward. Maybe the maybe the people mover has a chance. I'm really starting to think that now. <laughs> Post in the comments. What is your thoughts on all this treehouse uh, extravaganza? <sighs> we knew they were going to respond. Uh, Disneyland, no way they didn't say anything today or announcement wise. But I'm glad. I'm glad we got to do more news. So uh, I'll, I'll do my best to see if we could get any visuals on this concept art and then kind of make sense of it all. Uh, I'll talk around and uh, see if we could get more cheese mint on this treehouse. And I think it's just going to be simple as that. It's just a place for kids to go. And uh, it'll be kind of cool. Nothing spectacular. And probably just relate a lot to the new mo or new show that's coming on Disney Plus and connect the dots uh, from that aspect. So more Disney Plus coming to life at the theme park. All right, everybody. Don't forget to smash that like button on the way out. And thank you for supporting the fire. Oh, before I go, stay tuned. Tomorrow, the big day, live streams, vlogs, shorts, whole lot of fun coming. 
for Christmas at Disneyland. It's the big kickoff, and we got a lot to cover, so we're going to have a lot of fun at Disneyland holiday season. All right, everybody, don't forget to smash that like button on the way out, and thank you for supporting the fire. We are firing it down, firing it down. The Cat Lee Bay is calling it a day. I'm the main host, Mondo. Ah!